My name is Jim Jacob. I'm a surgical oncologist with a primary focus on breast cancer and melanoma. Patients undergoing mastectomy now have the option of combined reconstructive procedures. And in doing that, for a group of patients, we can actually preserve everything that's seen on the outside, the entire breast skin and the nipple, the areola complex, and combine that with the plastic surgeon performing a reconstructive procedure. So that is an excellent option for specific patients. It can give an excellent cosmetic result and make patients feel restored or whole um, are terms that are uh, frequently used. As a high volume breast center, we have breast surgeons who are focused on all aspects of surgical management of breast cancer from lumpectomy and oncoplastic surgery and reconstructive procedures with the plastic surgeons such as nipple sparing mastectomy. And so we have a combined team and we can perform operations under one anesthesia combined with the cancer removal portion as well as prioritizing and optimizing the aesthetic outcomes, whether that be an oncoplastic lumpectomy with a breast reduction or a lift, a mastopexy, or a nipple sparing mastectomy in which all of the skin and the nipple areolar complex are preserved simultaneously with implant or autologous reconstruction. Clinical trials allow us to offer tomorrow's treatments today. And so I think patients who have a cancer diagnosis really should explore the clinical trials available. Most clinical trials are giving the best treatment compared to what we think is gonna be the future best treatment.